10. We are told to exercise to stay healthy. But one Dublin doctor finds it may be the wrong prescription for some patients, especially if they've just finished eating. Yeah. Donna De Palma came to see Dr. Summit Shaw to be tested for food allergies, but her allergy is different. It comes and it goes. You've been eating wheat before, no problem. Right. And you were exercising before, no problem. Right. <laughs> Dr. Shaw, an Ohio health allergist, says food allergies are on the rise around the country. Among the most common are nuts and eggs. But in the last year, he's seen a new problem so unusual that he shared it at a World Allergy Conference meeting. When they combine eating a certain specific food and then exercising right afterwards, they have an anaphylactic or otherwise known as a serious allergic reaction. And these involve unusual foods like celery, bread and fruit. Donna, who exercises regularly, noticed that her eyes started to itch after she ate pasta, then got on a treadmill. I scratched my eyes a little bit, and within about five minutes, my eyes started swelling up quite a bit, um, to the point where it actually obstructed my vision. Weeks later, while exercising, she had a worse reaction. But if she ate wheat products and didn't exercise, she had no problem. So she asked Dr. Shaw for help. He says exercise increases blood flow and absorption in the stomach, so that may play a role in the allergic reactions. Meanwhile, he tells his patients. We ideally would like them to exercise on an empty stomach and definitely not after eating those um, specific causative foods. I haven't had any problems since, but I am a little bit paranoid. <laughs> Dr. Shaw says only a small number of his patients have shown these intermittent food allergies. He says if your eyes or your throat itch after eating or if you experience stomach pains, you should see any allergist to get tested for possible food allergies.